I've written a series of poems as letters, all different kinds of letters. And this is another one about, the, about grieving. And it, it, it's called Letter to One Who May or Not May Not Be in Jiangsu Province. I walk among the gravestones, the Henrys, the Margarets and Sophias, one Mark Theodore. Before death's noisy rustle, I did not know this rasp. How my voice would go as you have gone so soon. Or where, which latitude? Was it north or south? Now excavating with my planchettes, a shovel, a brush and pen, point east to China seas. Through a world's core I look for you, exhume ash and wood. Along the banks of Quinhai, the forests grow lush with blue amid a hapless stirring. My trowel brushes a desiccated onion, a skin. I quarry the red heart and spade toward this or another day. Kneeling low, feet almost shy and propped in tidy furrows, I write of grief's famine on the page's throat, on a parched fold. When you see the mulch crumble in the light, look for the mute who bears a foot, a palm, a conch as offering. Like the woman in Jiang Su who listens an ear to the earth, this shell holds the other chamber where green sounds shush east and west. Between the lines crisscross, invigilate which way on what meridian we rest. are inspired by the Pacific Northwest, and so this is a little bit on the Northwest. On Jedediah Island, generations return to beach one foot on shore. The dead hobble among us in old shoes. I slip between the nudge of elder shins, the histories that limp in half-told days. Lost shoes, scattered amid the detritus of seaweed and stone, speak of ancestral treks braced with whiskey. Tales, too, of those gone a week, a month, now caught in the drift of tongues. Beyond Clare Point, shoe ships flail as tides shepherd them along. Bodies, like smitten masts, tilt far off with arms thrown to the wind shear. Barefoot, I pick my way past knotted strings. Arches bridge upon the sand, make prints where water seeps. With pressure, marks seem indelible, a hold past place, my roost. No one really wants to go. Splash makes an eddy, a noose. I step, step away and watch one foot become confused between land's tether and the sea. Does it know Madagascar? Is this China or Ceylon? Where are the antique lanterns, the beacons who light the lost to home fires, to pairs of glowing slippers? 